Greetings, Scorpio here, and this is Rage Shadow Legends free to play challenge for 2024. Challenge is powered by Hell Hades team, and I'm a member of Team Scratch. Okay, so um, I've been off for a few days uh, from the recording, but I want to uh, show you guys uh, what I've been working on. Yeah, um, so the first and the most important thing uh, I think is the Arman Souls. So I was doing some events and tournaments. So currently I'm stick up uh, about 800 points. Uh, so 200 still missing. So that's my goal. Uh, four star. Mm. So because uh, yeah, I think five star is uh, not not reachable uh, for me at this moment because I skip few things. Uh, but also this legendary book is very important here. So that's for the Armands uh, stuff. We got currently CVC ongoing. Um, besides that, yeah, uh, what I'm doing? Uh, I'm training three, three new champs. Uh, so this is Arbiter, um, Skiramis and Ugo. So I'm training them uh, for the Hydro team uh, because I've probably mentioned on the previous episode uh, building a Hydro team because of the champs that I currently have. Uh, so let's quickly check what is my last uh, results. So I cannot show today any, any fight but I'll just uh, show the, the result. So it's over 6 millions. So that was my uh, just quick attempt uh, to, to, to run the team without any, any control uh, but I did some uh, controlled uh, run uh, previously with lower levels and I will show this on the board in a second but that's that's the main goal so I'm trying to get uh, as much uh, damage there to get more points um, so let's quickly check where we are so currently day uh, 75 two weeks to go so the challenge will end in two weeks um, yeah, so that's generally that's the final push. push. Um, okay, so now let's jump to the uh, leaderboards and see what's going on there. Okay, so we are on uh, hellhades.com uh, uh, site, free to play uh, challenge. And now let's take a look to the leaderboards. Um, so here we go all the content creators. So currently I'm sitting at 9381 9, uh, points. So let's switch to the community because let's see how you guys are also doing uh, here. Um, yeah, and so let's switch to general over, over, overall view. So at this moment I'm fourth. A uh, few guys here they are doing pretty good. So JS Food, uh, Panda, uh, Snackbag, right? So they are doing pretty great. Uh, behind me, uh, Corret is very close. Uh, yeah, that's good. Uh, from the content creators, who else here? Mullet River, Briggs, uh, Odd One Gaming. Yeah, uh, the guys also doing great work here. Uh, so let's uh, switch back to the leaderboards and let me uh, show you what I mean about uh, Hydra. So where is the Hydra? Doom Tower, Hydra here. Uh, so uh, you will be getting a lot of points uh, from the Hydra if you have very good uh, damage here. Uh, so guys here they managed to put a lot of uh, damage, so 53 million, 25 million, that, that's a lot. Uh, and let's uh, scroll down to the um, description how the points, points are calculated. So here for Hydra uh, clan boss, for every 100,000 uh, damage deal to the Hydra, uh, you will gain 5 points, right? So for 1 million it will be 50, for 10 million it will be 500. Uh, yeah, so let's say uh, 50 million, it will be uh, 2,500. So 2,500. Uh, that, that, that's a lot of points, right? So 
that, that's a very good source of point. Yeah, so if you're trying to win such a challenge just to find uh, where, where you can get some points. Uh, so general, I think that that's the good, good idea. Um, uh, I need to clarify one thing because uh, my clan boss team is pretty bad at, at this moment. So I'm doing like 16 to... I think the most uh, damage we got almost 20 million for the nightmare. So this will give me... Um, it is 5 points per million. So 10 million is 50. Uh, 20... Uh, 100 points uh, times 6, so it will be like 600 points. Uh, so benefit and the difference uh, between uh, dealing 20 millions on Nightmare and 20 millions on Nightmare 2 will be like 400 points, if I calculate this correctly. But here on Hydra, the, the difference will be much higher if you get more damage there. So I think it's worth to uh, focus on Hydra to get more damage if your um, clan boss is more or less okay, but uh, the investment to, to uh, go to the Ultra Nightmare, Nightmare will be very huge and yeah, we'll be getting uh, less points. So generally that's my thinking, uh, so that's how I'm approaching and probably also the guys here on the leaderboards, so happy with that. Uh, yeah, uh, I s we see some good. Uh, so let's quickly uh, check also other uh, main dungeons. So here we got Dragon, so Heart 7. Impressive. You guys are doing a pretty good job here. I think I cleared uh, Heart 1. Ice Golem, yeah, 22 on normal, but I see Panda is doing already uh, Heart 5. That's great. Uh, Fire Knight, yeah. 25 uh, that's the best results here i'm doing 23 but uh, i haven't tried for for some time we'll need to back to this spider so i completed 25 now yeah, i've got one crazy uh, competitor here with uh, interesting <laughs> achievement heart six pretty pretty damn good yeah uh, besides oh, minotaur arcane the, all the keeps that's that's generally nothing because everything is uh, already at this stage of the game should be at the max level mm, iron twins yes yeah, so stage nine uh, most of the guys here am i here somewhere not not even close okay some devil um i'm, I'm clearing seven uh that was some time ago so 13 is the top uh, score here and uh, shogun growth 14 yes yeah, so let's I, I'm, I'm doing 10 okay no, no, not, not bad yeah so for each level is some additional points but this will give me like maybe 50 points uh from just uh, jumping from 10 to, to 14 or, or 15 something like that but so the, the hydra is the most important thing for me uh, if you want to get most points here okay so that will be all from the little board so let's jump back to the game okay so we are back to the game so let's quickly uh, take a look how i'm building my uh, hydra champs here so arbiter um, Moreover, uh, 200 speed, uh, 222. Uh, generally, some survivability. So, immortal, more HP, uh, some uh, HP regeneration. That that's the goal. Heal here, just survive as long as possible. Uh, so, Skeramis, uh, so he's very good jump. So, placing provoke 100% on free turn cooldown. Uh, it's very good for Hydra and also decrease attack um, on all enemies but 75% uh, that should be good enough uh, so and i'm uh, building equip him with uh, provoke set so if um, i want to have more provoke so even his a1 and a2 will have a chance to provoke uh, the hydra head 
so for Ugo, I decided to build him with uh, some uh, perception, for sure, because of the debuffs that he she brings, and also Hex. Uh, so Hex is giving uh, this 50% uh, chance to uh, place a Hex debuff for two turns. Uh, and because uh, Ugo is uh, attacking here with A2, uh, with putting decreased defense uh, block debuff, so additional hex uh, debuff will be very useful here. It's really full combo. And then if Rattalus will hit, uh, so he will put more damage uh, to the heads uh, under the head, uh, hex. So that's the concept. Uh, generally, it's working. Um, yeah, so that, that, that's the plan here. Okay, so besides that, I think, um, yeah, uh, I'll need to one things to do. So uh, let's try the luck uh, today. So I'm not able to use Brogni, but I'm preparing him for the my clan boss uh, team. Uh, so what I need from him uh, is to two books to land on his uh, Avery. <laughs> so let's have. Uh, let's take a look if I will be able to um, do that on, on the video. Uh, not yet, but uh, A2 is also good. Uh, so this um, removing uh, buffs from all enemies. So uh, from the clan boss it's beneficial because you can uh, just strip off the uh, increase uh, attack. Yeah. Okay, let's put another two maybe this time. Okay, once again not. Okay, not lucky. Uh, <laughs> okay, but uh, for HP burn, so all, all books are valuable for him. Uh, so let's see, okay. And so no books landed uh, where I need it. So I still need a lot of more books. So two, five, seven more books. So to make him work. So that's the, the plan for the uh, future. So after the challenge will end, I'll be building the clan boss team for the Ultra Nightmare. It will be interesting. So if you want to uh, check what I'll be doing, I'll be sharing on the uh, probably next episode or maybe one another because next probably will be about the Hydro Run. Yeah, so that will be all. So please let me know in the comments what do you think about this approach? Do you agree with my plan? Or maybe you have some uh, suggestion how to improve? And see you on the next one. Cheers.